first step we'll press uh, Windows or the start key with the combination of U key now here in keyboard section uh, we will see on screen keyboard just slide this uh, toggle to off uh, if you find it turned on and then check if um, the on screen keyboard is turned off uh, second uh, option or second method is we press windows and R key in here we type O S K and press enter now on this keyboard you will see options button on the bottom of the screen which is right bottom third key uh, click on options in options you need to find control whether the on-screen keyboard starts when I cycle now click on this control whether the um, keyboard starts when I sign in see uh, if it is uh, checked then make it unchecked and let's see if it changes once done check if the key, uh, check and restart your computer and see uh, if on screen keyboard is gone third option is to press windows and R key type in R E G E D I T press enter click yes if you get a, a UAC prompt okay now in re registry we need to navigate to H key local machine software Microsoft and then Windows I'll press W and uh, here Windows and then current version in here we'll go to authentication in authentication we'll go to logon UI let me expand this tree in logon UI uh, let's expand that tree we will find a key saying show tablet keyboard double click it and set its value to zero if you find it one just make it zero and save the changes restart your computer or log off and log on your computer and see if the keyboard is gone fourth option is we press windows and R key we type services.msc in services.msc we need to find the service saying touchscreen keyboard and handwriting panel Let's press T. Here it is. Touch keyboard and handwriting panel services. Right click on it and click on stop. Once it is stopped, right click on it, click on properties. In general tab, you will find startup type as automatic. Select disabled from this drop down and apply the changes. Now after you have done this change you will need to restart your computer once done check if the keyboard is gone fifth method is to use command prompt we click on start menu and type cmd right click on command prompt and select run as administrator click on yes if you get a USC prompt now in the command prompt type sc space c-o-n-f-i-g config in quotation marks tablet input service start is equals to 
disable press enter once done we type sc stop tablet input service and press enter C space config tablet input service start is equal to auto C start tablet input service center now log off and log on your computer and see if you are still getting the all sync keyboard sixth method is stop windows 10 apps from starting apps to open the all sync keyboards start them now come okay, press windows and r key type in app with dot cpl now in here uh, find out any app that uses the on-screen keyboard on the logon. Um, if if you if you can find that app uh, and you're sure that this app can cause uh, the on-screen keyboard to pop up on logon, just uninstall that app and then restart your computer and see if the problem is solved. Uh, alternatively, you can open Task Manager. Uh, right click on taskbar and then select task manager and you can go to startup and disable the uh, certain you know startup task that causes the on-screen keyboard to pop up and see if that solves the problem I hope this video will be helpful for you thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe